hour to attend this seminar on sexual harassment in the workplace. Now please join me in welcoming the head of the uh, School of Self-Defense in Hollywood, Mr. Sweet Tooth Jones. <laughs> Sugar bear. <laughs> step to the left, step to the right, like it's all right. <laughs> now, normally, I don't work for the man, but word on the street is that some cats been jiving y'all at the file cabinet. They up to no damn good. Actually, Mr. Tooth, <laughs> that's sweet tooth, sister. Right on. Stay loose, kittens. Lay your number on me, sister. What's the scene? Okay, so I'm, I'm at the filing cabinet, right? Oh, I did. And I, I'm bending over to get a file, and someone grabbed my rear. I mean, they just I like, heard grabbed that. It. Well, I'm looking at your booty now, uh, Snow White. Look at that. Round as Pam Grier's. And coffee. You see coffee? Sheba, baby. Cleopatra Jones. Say what, baby? Well, but wait a minute. What do I do next time it happens? Because I really don't like it that much. Let me tell you something. If you're too uptight to groove and the dude won't get off your tail, check this. Step up. Let's do this. Come on. Demo time. You got to arch that. Arch that. There you go, Queen B. Gang! Say, Mama, why don't we go back to my office and you can take some dictation? Up yours, Jive Turkey. <laughs> <laughs> Any questions? Excuse me, Mr. Sweat Tooth. Why did you attack the girl? Do unto others before you get your butt whipped. Excuse me, what are you talking about? What am I talking about? I'm talking about straight, unadulterated kung fu, baby. Something you probably don't know nothing about. Now, don't get me mad. <laughs> Let's go, scenario numero B, let's go. I dig your groovy boots, white mama. How'd you like to climb up my corporate ladder? Back off, Jack Turkey. Excuse me. You got any questions? You've just beaten this woman up twice. What lesson are we learning? My visually vicious, yet totally painless attacks on this woman are but a metaphor for life. That's right. You got to watch your back. Totally painless? You know nothing about karate! Hey, and I never said I did. <laughs> I'm a fight choreographer right. out of Hollywood. That's right, you are. And I know Townsend in them. <laughs> <laughs> but I can really throw down. You want to see? Huh, you want some of this, Mama? Come on. Huh? <laughs> Tamara Dobson was Cleopatra Jones. <laughs> hey, 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 you got root. Damn, Rich. Damn, Rich. Man, get on me and start the music, man. Do the rock. Good 
Bigfoot. You think you're tough, don't you, Ken? Huh? Well, here's your wake-up call. Excuse me. Uh, hi. Are you the guidance counselor? Have a seat. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Name's Ed Bacon. What's your name, son? Uh, John. John? John. Yeah, John. Let me just get out the John file. <laughs> John. Yeah, John. John. John said John. John with no eight. What do you know? There's 200 freaking Johns in this school. <laughs> Maybe you're one of the lucky ones whose dad actually stuck around long enough to give him a class name. It's John uh, Sanders. John Sanders. John Sanders. S A N D E R S. John Sanders with, with an S at both ends. Sanders. <laughs> Okay, Sanders, here we are. It's coming right up here. Take, take, take your time, you seem tense. I'm just fine. Okay. John. All righty. Now, John, according to this, you've been spending a lot of time in art class there. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm uh, hoping to be a painter. Interesting. Yeah. What about the Marines, son? The Marines? I'm just suggesting that because you seem a little poofy to me. A little sweet in the pants, you know what I mean? Yep, I'd definitely say the Marines are for you, John. Make you tough. Take a shot at me. Come on! It'd be good for you, John. It'd be real good for you. All right, Mr. Bacon, you can spit on my dreams if you want to, but uh, I'm going to show you and everybody. I, uh, someday I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be a painter. Well, then. By all means, paint. Just paint your sissy little heart out. <laughs> Hell, I've just been doing this for 15 years. What do I know? Huh? I'm an idiot. Right? I did. Get out of my son. <laughs> Get out! <laughs> and don't call me from the homeless shelter either! Everything all right? Uh, what's with John? I guess he just had a little bite from the big reality sandwich, and he started to choke on it. Who are you? Uh, Danita Clark, you sent for me. Right, Danita. I've been looking over your file. I see you've been studying ballet lessons for 14 years. That's right. I'm going to be a ballet dancer. I'm going to spend the summer in London studying at the Royal Academy. Mistake. Have a seat, Danita. <clears throat> I've taken a personal interest in your career. Now, why would you want to go all the way to London when you could pursue your dream right here in the States? How? As a stripper. <laughs> There's good money in stripping. I don't care. I'm going to be a ballet dancer. Wake up, Danita! You're not very pretty and you're not very smart. So you can thank your lucky stars that God gave you such a great rack. <laughs> it's your choice, Danita. Strip or starve. <laughs> Mr. Baker! Now, now, Danita. I know this seems harsh, but I'm telling you now because in 10 years, those knockers of yours are going to be down around your ankles. <laughs> That's what happens with big ones like yours. It's a little law called gravity, Danita. Now, here's what I want you to do. Drop out of school immediately. Go see my friend Kenny at the Jug Shack. Address her on those matches. <laughs> yep. I can still make a difference. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't Marlon Keene. You know, they used to say you couldn't score below 400 on the SAT. It's an honor to meet the man who proved them wrong. 
Nice to meet you, Mr. Bacon. He speaks! Oh, Marlon? It seems that even a cud-chewing cretin like yourself is entitled to work. So, why don't we pull out the old career skills manual and see what magnificent opportunities await somebody with your special needs. <laughs> now, let's see. Ah, here's one. Neck ringer at the slaughterhouse. You'd have to be smarter than the chickens to catch them. <laughs> Garbage man. That's like putting a kid in the candy store. Here we go. No skills, no brains required. And that would leave only one profession. It would uh, be... What does it say? Guidance counselor. What? I can't hear you. Guidance counselor. Guidance counselor! Thanks for your advice, Mr. Bacon. But I think I'll hold out and do something better. All right? <laughs> Anybody say 350? Come on, for the super hunk over here. Come on, go at once. Go at twice. Come on now. Sold to the lady in the front row for $300. Yes. All right, go get him. Come on now. They've got jungle fever. All right, all right. Next, we have a celebrity hunk. You want me to bring him out? Yeah! I can hear y'all. Okay. Let's welcome Mr. Luther Van Draw. Come on. Station today, okay? Hey, you are my man. You want to give these lovely ladies a little preview of what a date would be like with you? Oh, let me let me run it by you. First, we'll uh, sail out on my private yacht, you know, all alone under the stars, because uh, everybody knows everyone needs love. The bidding started at three hundred dollars. What do you say? Three hundred. I give it three hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars right here. Four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars right there. Four fifty. Four fifty right up front. Five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars. I heard five hundred dollars, but honey, you got to show your face. It ain't gonna be all that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. watch yourself. Whoa. Five Chill out, Urkel. I ain't with that stuff. <laughs> hey, Superstar, come here. Come here. Huh? I've been fantasizing about you and kissing your picture and stuff. You look like you've been kissing a weed whacker. <laughs> <laughs> come with you. He's so crazy, and he is, he's sexy, too, and crazy. I can't wait to take you on our dream date. I'm going to take you to Meaty Meaty Burger, and then we're going to get some cheeseburger and stuff. And then we're going to go home and then pick the cheese out of our teeth and stuff. And then we're going to creep, 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 creep. Why don't you creep your butt back to the swamp? Why don't you mind your business? Them big glasses. <laughs> okay, we're at $500. Who's going to top that for a date with Luther? Come on. 500 come on. 550 550 right there. $575. There it is. Uh, anyway, uh, $700, please. What? $700. Uh, uh, just keep saying to yourself, this is a charity event, okay? Yeah, okay, don't, but, but, but where did she get the money? Uh, gorilla hey, contest? Man. I don't know. <laughs> don't worry about where I get my money. I get my money. That's all you got to worry about. And plus, you know, you know, my house was kind of uh, deconstructed in the earthquake and stuff, you know. Yeah, it looked like the San Andres fault was right across your damn face. <laughs> It's registering a 6.6 .6 on the ugly scale. Oh. 
<laughs> oh, so y'all got jokes and stuff, huh? Well, I'll tell you what, ain't nobody gonna outbid Juan Dwayne. That's all you need to know. Uh, look, Is which it? one of y'all ladies are gonna rescue? I mean, which one of y'all are gonna bid for Luther? Come on, man. We're talking about a real catch here. It says here that, um... He's active in all kind of charitable organizations. See, that's good, because that's a turn on. See, because I like that. See, I like a man like that. I like it. He needs to donate his manhood to the Wanda Foundation. Hey! Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. See, I don't know where you get your information from. Uh, it's right uh, here. No, 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 that's all wrong. I hate charities. I don't like them. I'm selfish. Hey, well, see, that's, that's good. See, you selfish. That means you keep me out to yourself. I don't like sharing. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. See, you, you don't understand. See, I'm, I'm no good. I'm low down. I'm known to be low down. I'm what? scum. I don't know what you're talking about. I done dated all kinds. I dated prisons. Don't you know Shank and Rampage? <laughs> okay, look, the bidding starts at 700 Who can put that down? Come on, now. Look, I'll bid $750. $750? So, hey, that ain't fair. That ain't fair. That's $900. You better, light skin, you better get on. Uh, $900. $1,000. Uh, $1,000, uh, child. $1,036. Hold on a second. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to show you something. $37. Uh, and I got some pesos. You know, work is good south of the border. Hi. Oh, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. That's that. That's enough of that. I bid $5,000. Good, because I need some money. Uh, now, who do I make the check out uh, to? Luther, I don't think that you can do that, man. No, let him make no, the wait, check. Wait. I'm ready to come. Uh, Luther, man, I'm really insulted. Okay, wait, this wait, is wait. a charity don't, event. I don't want you insulted. You know, I don't mean to dish you. Okay. You know what well, I mean? Wait. You know that, that purple Mercedes outside? Right. The, it's actually Keys. plum color. Keys. Right there. And it's for you. Don't play with me. Let's, let's get on out of here. <laughs> hey, come on. That's my donation. Well, am I? Uh, ladies, you can pick your coats up front. Right. <laughs> get on out of here, then. Girl, who you looking at? Better get your hair fixed next time. Because I don't need no man. I can make it on my own and stuff. You know, it ain't like I need somebody. <laughs> so does this mean uh, that you going to rock my world? No, that's just a rose. Anyway, though, you know, it's all good. <laughs> and now, from Detroit, Def Jam Chaos recording artist performing Progress of Elimination. Give it up for Boss! We got the roughest, roughest G you ever see, yo! Roughest G you ever see, yo! Hey, yo, 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 what's up? How y'all feel? Check it, check it, check it out. Check it, check it. Who am I to pick? Now look at this. Business is business, but now the revelation has revealed how the boss is trying to get rich. You're doing a good job. I'm ripping up the payment with nothing to pay. I think I jumped into a maze. And now I'm busy around till my damn body's in a day. Some kind of way I have become a slave. Yes, the master. I work faster. Even if it means my brain being tampered with. Pump it. At least I got rid of the